Hi everyone, today I'm going to be talking about Atlas Moths. I'm just saying it in British because I'm making it a little funny. So, these are the ones we have. Hands are slippy. Oh, what was I pointing the piano? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, okay, here we go. The atlas moths are right here. So, we have our female atlas moth, our male atlas moth. The female is bigger because um, it has a fur farther distance than flying than the male. And also to attract their mates. So, the male also attracts mates with smaller wings because they look like, uh, like a nice little guy that they're not really so harmful like that little buddy so we have like maybe one i'm not sure upper wing down or wing other side same eh. these triangles are part of the pattern to also scare away their prey. I mean, their predator. So, but, but atlas moths are actually very poor pets because they would only live up to, I mean, because, not because they're aggressive or anything. And, um, Because they, because uh, because they actually have a very, very short life of of distance. Because because they're because they die in only ten to seven days. So here we. We have also um, other types of moths and butterflies, like the Cecropia moth, the the um, and the Gypsy moth, the Indian Moon moth, the lots of moths actually. So actually, that was for today's video, and don't forget to push the like button, I mean, so don't forget to push the like button and subscribe, and I would see you in the next video. Bye!